Call it wait. Something just broke in the bed. In the bed. Nappy boy, win squad, nigga. That's my team. My team. Ballin', stuntin', drinkin', smoking, mm. nigga. This is my team. Mm. Okay. This is my stone and I'm be up the crown, cause I this is my team. Okay. And I be start the style and I'm be drive them wild cause this is my team. Okay. If you want me come money, then I have to work for me, cause this is my team. Okay. They might want to stop me, but they might just cut me, cause this is my team. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Nigga. Nigga. Whipping expensive whips ass nigga. nigga They be tryna hold me but they know I got a rollie That'll make your fucking wrist go limp my nigga, my nigga. Huh. You a simp my nigga. nigga I bet your pocket full of lint my nigga. nigga Everybody knows that I put it on these hoes Gotta sound like a motherfucking chimp my nigga <laughs> Welcome to the jungle dog. Yeah. Balenciaga by the bundles dog. Yeah. My bitch gotta put a helmet on My wide receiver don't fumble balls I'm rich as fuck and y'all like that, shit. like that shit Smoke good nigga like that split Throwing money in the club make it right back bitch And I'm drinking like I don't know what a nightcap is <laughs> Cause I ball too much. much Money too heavy in the mall with a crutch Get a quarter pound and a kush Fuck around later on Put it all in the Dutch That bitch boy win squad Nigga that's my team, my team. Ballin', stuntin', drinkin', smokin' mm-hmm. Nigga this is my team yeah. okay. This is my stone and I'm be up the crown Cause I this is my team okay. And I be start the style and I be drive them wild Cause this is my team okay. If you want me come money then it have to work for me Cause this is my team okay. They might want to stop me but they might just cut me Cause this is my team here we go. 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 Fuck nigga, this a my team. My team. Bitch nigga, this a my team. My team. Pussy hole, this a my team. This a my team. This a my team. Yo, fuck boy, this a my thing. When the girl them see me, them said this a my king. Hey boy, I'm in a really care when I like him. TP and you know, I'm a dog, big up the Viking. Sidekicks couldn't see me when I'm on a mission. No sidekick, just a nigga with a trigger and a cool head. Balls for the cause, I'm a boss for the boss. I'm an OG with a G tucked in my drawers. Ahead of my time with an animal rhyme. Uh, like LMNS Buster Rhymes. Eee, gotta finesse all my lines. Eee, gotta impress all the dimes. So when they see me right away, they know this a my thing. I don't play no games, you're dismiring. Champion thing. Autograph the jersey. Melt them balls like Hershey. Lot of mercy, curse me. Just don't push me, now make me lift up your skirt, expose your nature I don't rate you, to me you're garbage Couple bodyguards don't make you the hardest Artist, no sir, just a punk in the fur I'm a hunk and I don't smoke skunk Just murder the basement in your trunk Clip your wing if a pussy want to test car This is my thing, do it! Okay! This is my stone and I'm be up the crown Cause I this is my thing! Okay. And I be start the style and I be drive them wild Cause this is my thing! Okay. If you want me come money then it has to work for me Cause this is my thing! Okay. They might want to stop me but they might just cut me Cause this is my thing! Here we go! Good, you two. That's what I need to hear back again. Uh, once again, and take you today. We're here for episode number 20 of our Pokemon Storm Silver Egglock here on the channel. It's been 20 episodes already. That's insane. That's insane. It seems like just yesterday 
We were hatching illegal eggs. We just started the egg clock. But we're here for episode number 20 in the last episode, which if you missed it, it actually went up on Saturday, two days ago, instead of last Friday. I know me sleeping late on Wednesday pushed everything back. Wednesday's episode was uploaded on Thursday. Friday's episode was uploaded on Saturday. But it's okay, because we're here on Monday. We're back. We're ready to go. Everything's Gucci. It's amazing. We're good to go. But if you missed our last episode, it was an hour of power, and it was an hour of very unfortunate events. I'm not going to spoil it for you guys, but we were able to go ahead and safely take back control of the Safari Zone. So again, if you missed out the last episode, I definitely recommend blah, 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 blah. I definitely recommend you go back and check it out. It's early in the morning right now, you guys. I woke up an hour ago. I took a shower. I have a cup of coffee. We're going to wake up together right now, okay? We're going to wake up together. But still, I recommend you go back and check out the last episode. In today's episode, you guys, we are here. We are ready to go. We are ready to take on Jasmine and earn our sixth Johto League gym badge and possibly make our way to Mahogany Town. So if you guys are hyped for today's episode of Storm Silver, and of course, if you're a proud member of the Happy Nation, make sure you smash that like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. And of course, if we can break a powerful 6,000... 7,000 likes on today's episode and Wednesday's episode and Friday's episode will be an hour of power. I, I didn't mean to accidentally raise the like goal like that. My fingers just came up. But you know what? It's okay because there's been a lot of you guys saying that even 6,000 likes wasn't enough. The Nappy Nation can come through and demolish any goal we set. So I'm going to say 7,000 for today and Wednesday's episode. And let's see if we can destroy that. Now, we did have a grinding montage on today's episode. So let's go ahead and get a quick team recap for you guys because our team is looking very, very different than last episodes. We have our Jolly Nature Church. If you scared, motherfucker, go to church. Our Medicam, I almost said Meditite, holding the choice band the high jump kick psycho cut bullet punch and ice punch that pure power oh, oh, oh it's so dangerous oh it's so dangerous it's just walking destruction up next we have our na modest nature i will say nudist nature modest nature quasimodo holding the leftovers it is our hunt tail rock and surf ice fang body slam and bite quasimodo was our savior in the last episode he came through he bulked them hits from the evil gyarados and and just saved it saved the lock entirely Save the lock entirely. Up next, we have our Adamant Nature Terror, the Torterra. Tor God damn, say that ten times fast. Terror, the Torterra. Holding the leftovers, rocking Z Bomb, Curse, Superpower, and Earthquake. I honestly don't see Terror's moveset ever changing. It's it's perfect the way it is. Unless they gave me. I don't know. <laughs> it's perfect the way it is. Up next, we have our Adamant Natured Fang, the Shell God. Our little Bagon did, in fact, evolve. It's holding the leftovers because it's being a little bulky right now. Uh, Rockin' Rockhead was Headbutt, Zen Headbutt, Bite, and Dragon Dance. I actually got rid of Dragon Rage on him because Dragon Rage is very, very good early on in the game. But now we're starting to get to the point where it's like... Dragon Rage isn't exactly the smartest move we could go for. Dragon Rage only does 40 damage, but most people we're fighting will have, like... 110 health or something like that. So it would take three Dragon Rages to kill, whereas we could do 50% uh, with Zen Headbutt or 60% with uh, a Bite or something like that, you know? So we don't have any stab moves right now, but very, very soon we shall. Up next, we have our uh, n another new member to the party, our Adamant Nature Gonzalez. Uh, the Tauros, I went in and gave him the choice band because Tauros is the fastest member in our party. Tauros is one of the fastest Pokemon in the game, period. Uh, so I went ahead and banded him because he is a little glass cannon he will hit hard but he cannot take a hit so he's rocking rock slide zen headbutt pursuit and takedown for now not the world's greatest move set um and i didn't think about this at first whoever sent us this i don't know if you meant to give us intimidate or not because you gave us the tm for rock slide which i mean i guess he learns and it's good coverage of course but a lot of times people were run rock slide and zen headbutt on a sheer force Tauros because that gets rid of the chance to flinch that gets rid of the chance oh, on both moves gets rid of the chance to flinch and powers them up I mean intimidates nice because we can use the intimidate drop to, to hopefully stall them on and swap into somebody that can take a hit but at the same time I can't help but feel like sheer force is what was intended but either way they're both amazing abilities I'm not complaining it's just Something that picked my brain. <laughs> but yeah, he's talking rock slides and headbutt pursuit and takedown. And last but not least, we have Drowska, our relaxed nature, leftovers holding, and Feroz, rocking Thunderbolt, Discharge, Takedown, and Thunder Wave. I had to teach Drowska Thunderbolt with the Thunderbolt TM that we got. I really didn't want to because it's an electric type Pokemon. Why don't you just learn Thunderbolt naturally? But Amphros doesn't. 
Even Dreano didn't give Amphro's Thunderbolt, so I went ahead and used Thunderbolt. And at the same time, I was thinking, if I need to get another team for Thunderbolt, I can always go back to the game corner and either buy coins or play Voltorb Flip to my heart's content and buy another uh, Thunderbolt TM. So that's where we're at right now. Not the best moveset on Drowska. Uh, I wouldn't really want, I don't know, both Discharge and Thunderbolt and Thunderwave. I don't know. We need to get Power Gem or some other shit on there for him. But either way... That is where we're at right- no, I'm hitting B instead of A. That is where we're at right now, so let's go out and make a deal! And of course, you see we leveled everybody up to level 40. Church is 41 because uh, after we came back from the Safari Zone, there were trainers along the route, where we paired with the uh, Gen 4 people before, so now there were trainers and he just got the experience there, okay? Leave him alone, leave him be, goddammit, wait, oh, 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 oh! Excuse me, I apologize. I am sorry. I did not mean to sneeze all over everybody like that. Alright, so let's go ahead and get up out of here and wait, 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 wait. We have 20 hyper potions. Okay, we are good to go. Let's go up in this bitch and let these niggas know we moving in. Let these niggas know we moving in. I mean in. Let these niggas know. Jasmine uses steel type Pokemon. She's trying to hide her tenderness behind her steely coldness. I don't know why you don't tell me any sort of advice. Who the hell is this? I knew you'd come here. Thank you for helping the gym leader, but battle is a separate matter. Go for it. Who the fuck are you? I thought it was Bayo, but at first. Who the fuck is that? Uh huh. I know how capable you are for the lighthouse. It's time you show that side of yourself to Jasmine. Good luck. What? What is the point? Like, are you supposed to be trainers in the gym? Like, what, what is the point in what you just did and what you just said? There's no, there is no point. There is no point. You're just being useless. All right, we're going to go ahead and save our game, even though we just started, because you guys already know what I'm about to say. Only you can prevent lost save data, so make sure you save that game for anything crazy goes down. And Jasmine scares me so much. Steel types are so crazy defensive. And, yo, we're leading with church. So that might be good. That might be good. We, we can ban ourselves in a high jump kick and just go to town. Let's see here. Thank you for help for your oh, for your help at the lighthouse. But this is different. Please allow me to introduce myself. Please allow me to introduce myself. I am Jasmine, a gym leader. I use the Clang Steel type. Do you know about this steel type? They're very hard, cold, sharp, and really strong. Um, I'm not lying. No one accused you of being a liar. Damn. Are, are you are you habitual? Are you a habitual liar and everyone thinks that you just lie all the time, Jasmine? So you have to, like, prove yourself that you're not- Oh, god damn it! And of course, you would start with somebody that- That's a neutral hit. I don't know if I can- I don't know if I should stay in and high jump kick it. Let's see here. Let's see here. I feel like he's rocking Ice Punch. I kinda wanna go out to Terror. No, I think in this game he has Levitate. I'm gonna high jump kick him. Fuck it. See how much we do. Pure power stab, banded. I know it's it's only neutral damage, but oh god damn! Oh god damn! Oh my goodness! Oh my damn! Oh my goodness! We go in there! Oh my god, Church, you are such a monster! Power trick? What does power trick even do? The user employs its psychic power to switch its attack and defense. That no, 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 no. Give up. It's a good idea, but I don't think we're gonna learn it. Skarmy, okay, we can't high jump kick that, so let's swap out, let's swap out. I'm gonna go out to Drowska. Let's give Drowska their first chance. She could hard switch to her Steelix right now, expecting or predicting, but we'll see what she ends up going for. Level 39. Toxic? Oh! You wanna stall out my bulky mods? I mean, that's, well, no, Sturdy works differently in Gen 4. I was gonna say, that's fine, because you're just gonna go for, or wait for the Sturdy. Or wait, or does that work because it's super effective? I can't remember how it works. No, it's not why. What's what's Skarmory's other ability? I don't know. 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 Cause I thought sturdy. I thought sturdy in Gen Four was. It would save you from super effective moves that would one shot or something like that. I don't remember. I don't remember. But Steelix is coming out now. Pretty sure this is going to be her ace, so we're going to go out to Terror. Who I think is the oldest mod in our party now? 
I think it is. Oh my goodness. Yes, that is her ace, level 40. So we train right up to the appropriate level. So my question is, do we seed bomb? I'm gonna curse. I'm gonna curse. I'm gonna curse. I'm gonna curse. So I can raise my defense. What is he gonna go for? Iron Tail. I mean, we don't resist. I never understood. How come? Wait, wait, wait. Um, no, don't do this to me. Alright, seed bomb. Seed bomb. Does still resist grass? Yeah, still resist a lot of shit. So that should be a neutral hit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, you know what's not gonna be a neutral hit? This goddamn earthquake. So how about you suck a dick, Jasmine? And your Steelix. Could you just imagine a battle between Steelix and Torterra? Like, IRL? That would be like the most monstrous, slow battle of all time. <laughs> Monstrously slow battle of all time. They'll be like, go for Earthquake! Go for Iron Tail! Wait, 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 wait. Uh, uh. <laughs> so stupid. I don't have anybody that has fire type moves. And Bug resists. Doesn't Bug resist fighting? Let me double check. Let me double check. Because sometimes I can't remember all of the type effectivenesses. Sis, 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 sis. Yo, they, re they resist each other. Ooh, bug resists fighting and fighting resists bug. Okay, so I can't high jump kick it. Mmm, I just don't want it to explode on me. I'm going to Drowska. I'm going to Drowska and I'm going to Thunder Wave it. Payback? Lol. Big payback! I'm going to Thunder Wave it so that we can try and keep it from exploding. We're self-destructing. How much damage can we do with a Thunderbolt? Oh my goodness. Oh, the paralysis is real! The paralysis is real! Let's go! Giggity goddamn! Fuck out of here! You ain't blowing up on nobody! Nobody! Who can live you like me? Nobody! Who can lay yo? Who can lay the smack down? Nobody, baby. And the band keeps playing on. On, 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 and on, on. Okay, I gotta stop. We're going to a whole other world. Alright, so she's got two mods left. We have Bronzong here now. Bronzong has Levitate, right? Let's find out. Not this one. Never mind. See, it must be a heat proof Bronzong. I was gonna say, I know it has Levitate and heat proof. So we just have to go for it and see what happens. That's crazy though because wasn't Chuck's ace like 37 or 38? And most of Jasmine's Pokemon are level 38 with an ace at 40. I trained up to 40 thinking she'd have like Steelix at 41 or 42. Magneton? I thought she had a Metagross. Oh wait, that's glazed. Never mind. God damn it! I was doing this whole battle, this whole episode without thinking about that terrible. Oh, you tricky bitch! Thinking about that terrible, terrible event. You know what? No, you have to die. You have to die. Flash Cannon? Oh, we'll eat that up. We'll eat that up. Terror will eat Flash Cannons for breakfast with no milk. Hold this superpower though. You magnet rise, you sneaky bitch. Sneaky fucking bitch. That's what I thought. Nice and critical hit. Terror coming through. Terror felt my anger. I, I channeled myself. I channeled my chakra through terror to allow terror to body that magneton like that. That's what just happened. Fuck you, Jasmine. Explosion ass Metagross. Fuck is wrong with you? Stupid ass. Give me my goddamn badge. I'm tired of this. I'm tired of this. I'm tired of you, Jasmine. I'm tired of you. My lord. Let me jot down my notes. I'm mad. She made me mad. God damn it. Pissing me off with this stupid shit. So I don't make any make any mistakes on the layout. Which I probably will, and somebody's gonna be like, Oh, look at you, Navi. You're a terrible fucking person because you forgot to change this on the goddamn layout. <laughs> you are a better trainer than me in both skill and kindness. In accordance with league rules, I confer upon you this badge. Goddamn mineral badge. You know, every time I get the mineral badge, I always wonder why is it called the mineral badge? Is it because is it because iron is a mineral? And because they it, don't they like turn iron into steel? Because she's a steel type gym leader. So why is her badge called the mineral badge? 
With Fed Badge, all Pokemon, including traded Pokemon up to level 70, will obey you without question. Um, please take this too. Level 70? Looks like we have a grinding montage next episode. Let's go all the way up to level 70, goddammit. <laughs> it's called Iron Tail. Your Pokemon will hit the target with its hard tail, occasionally lowering the target's defense. Occasionally, aka the first time she used it. God damn it. Alright, we register Jasmine so she can come and explode with her Metagross on us anytime she wants to. Alright, okay, you know what? This this is this is happening right now. But we should have more than enough HP to go ahead and slide to the Pokemon Center here. And we shall be gonna go! I still have no idea what that chick meant when she said flags were set in here. I have no idea, but the mysteries of Olivine will have to wait for another time. Ah! Hip hop, you don't stop, god damn it! I'll have to wait for another time because now it's time for us to say goodbye to Olivine City for now at least. Because we need to make our way to Mahogany Town. Mahogany. We need to make our way to Mahogany Town. And it's crazy that we've cleared out all of this. We spent so much time in Olivine City. Between Olivine and Sirewood, we spent so much time in that corner of the game. Triano adding that extra uh, event, that changed so much. Because before, like this area of the game, you would just breeze through so quickly. But we spent like the last five or six episodes down there, putt putting around. Kick it a goddamn. Let's get up out. Let's get up out. I'm done with this place. I'm excited to go to Mahogany Town. I don't know why I'm so excited. Oh, this thing is. Oh, I already talked to him. Never mind. I'm gonna stop off right here and see. Hello. Still no Komodo girls. God damn it. <laughs> I got ones I'm trying to get rid of. Let me pay your child support, baby. Let me stop. I support single mothers. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wait, don't we run into the sweet coon over here? I think we do. We got an escape room. How how handy dandy is that? How handy fucking dandy is that? Your Pokemon is looking around restlessly for something. What is it? Is there an item around here, Church? Why is this little gap here? I don't understand why this little section is there in those trees. Uh-oh. Oh boy! Sorry that I bumped into you! Did I hurt you? Please don't cry. Here, take this. See what a little bit of puppy dog guys get you? It's a move called Strength. When a Pokemon learns it, it can be move boulders out of your way. Enjoy a happy mountain climbing life. Fuck out of here. Okay, so we can get a new encounter on this route as well as a new encounter here in Mount Mortar. Yes, Mount Mortar. Mount Mortar, go ahead and yield me a Pokemon. Yield me a Pokemon to swap. Nice and later on, level 33. I will gladly accept that. I wonder, I was gonna say, oh, he is part rock. Never mind, it was a critical hit. So we don't get that Pokemon. God damn it! I'll have to come back and explore Mount Mortar during a grinding montage sometime. Because I know there's got to be a ton of items in there and trainers as well. So we're on Route 42. We can get an encounter here. Did you guys know you could actually encounter. Oh god. I was about to say Entei and Raikou on the water here. But look who, look who we found here. Look who it is, you guys! Oh, la, 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 la. oh this weekend just shows me out of the way. That's Pokemon on human violence. You know, if I shoved a Suicune, everybody would be all over me, saying, oh my god, you monster. And now because this Suicune shoves me, try after this Suicune, how brave it is. It's brave. How refreshing it is. It's refreshing. How beautiful it is. It's beautiful. And how quickly it moves. It moves quickly. Because it shoves me out the way. That's prejudice. Try after it. Nappy, you seem to be around where Suicune would appear. Well, that's okay. My desire to search for Suicune is far beyond yours. My grandpa was quite into myths. I've heard so many, so many stories about Suicune from him. Suicune, I won't stop following you until I've found out what you're after. You hear me? Well, fuck you too, you see. Your desire to find Suicune is more than mine. How about you go find a bag of dicks and get to work? Voltaic Ore. Oh, shit. I believe that's another trade item that uh, 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 Sir Drayano put in the game. A stone burst from a place with strong magnetic forces. Some Pokemon react with the energy contained inside. I think that's for Magneton to Magnezone. 
I believe. I believe it is. I believe it is. Or, um, nose pass and a probo pass, I think. How did I know this was there? How did I know? How did I know? How did I know? I wanna know! I don't care. That song, the beat to that song is fucking bees knees and it's gonna forever be stuck in my head. Alright, no, 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 no. I have bad memories of you from Soul Link. Let's not do that. Let's not do that. Let's, let's not and say we did. Let me demonstrate the power of the Pokemon I caught. Okay, so, so you want this work. That's what I thought. You want this work as well. It makes me feel sad that I, I, I tried to... I just killed a Quillfish, because Quillfish is a proud member of the motherfucking Tucson Terrakions, goddammit. It's okay, though. Mrs. Puff? That wasn't Mrs. Puff. That was one of Mrs. Puff's relatives. Just don't tell Mrs. Puff, and she'll, she'll stay on the squad. She'll stay on the team. Max motherfucking potion. You damn right. You damn right, nigga. You damn right. Is that another item I see? Is that another item I see? Oh no, you gotta go. You gotta go into what you call it with that. Yeah. Or you have to rock. You have to rock climb down to that item, right? Can I, can these Goldeen fuck off? Yeah, you have to rock climb down that item from Mount Mortar. Okay then, fine. You actually consider g coming over here? Wait, did I run for the Goldeen? God damn it! I'm so stupid sometimes. I swear to God, I'm so stupid sometimes. What's wrong with me? I ran from the Goldeen. <laughs> I was gonna say, I thought about coming down here to get the encounter for this route, but I, I was about to say, but I caught whatever's in the water before already, but I just remembered that I didn't actually catch what was in the water before. I didn't, I <laughs> fucking, Oh my goodness, I don't know what's wrong with me. I don't know what's wrong with me. Okay, I don't know who to go out to right now. Because I feel like... Okay, spikes. I was gonna say, Fortress just scares the shit out of me. And I really don't know how to handle it at times. Like, the Thunder Wave worked before, but... We got an Albade Orb. Isn't that the one that we got from... Whatchamacallit before? Yeah! From the, the, uh, the, uh, the Elder Sage. The Pervy Sage. The Toad Sage from the Tower. A dim sphere charged with the energy of sunlight and merriment. It causes a certain species of Pokemon to evolve. I wonder if that changes based upon nighttime and daytime. Like, if I came through here at nighttime, would it be the other one? For Umbreon? Because the Albedor, I'm pretty sure, is for Espeon. I don't know. But we've made it to Mahogany Town. Mahogany Town. And there's so much moving and shaking here in Mahogany Town. Oh my goodness, Mahogany Town. Mahogany Town. I don't know why, Mahogany Town is just, like, there's never been another city like it in the Pokemon world, you know what I mean? Like, in any generation. I don't know, you know what? No, I take that back. What is it, Lacunosa Town in 5th Gen? The one where you land in the airport? It's got the, it's in Bla Black 2, I almost said Blaze Black 2, Black 2, White 2? I think, I think, I think, I think. Young man, you should treat yourself, you're a Pokemon in a matter fit for a king. Maybe this little accessory will do so. The King's Rock. Hey, thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. I stop my Pokemon from evolving too early. I make them learn certain moves before I let them evolve. I'm just talking to everybody, see if anybody wants to give me some items. Everybody's talking about this man in black at the Lake of Rage, and I can only wonder who it's gonna be. And if I'm not mistaken, I'm pretty sure. What is it? Riley's house is here. Yeah, Buck and Riley. It's good to see you again, Nappy. Now that you're here, I can finally give you the reward I promised for helping us defeat Rocket. Oh, he wants to give us a Ryalu egg. Hey, Nappy, how's it going? We should totally have a smoking hot battle sometime. Okay, so all hope is not lost, you guys. All hope is not lost. We can still have a Mon to hatch from an egg. Huh? You heard wind blowing into this room. That's just me whistling. Enough about that. Why don't you want to buy something? I don't want any of these. Whack-ass shop. The experiment worked like a charm. Magic are just worthless, but Gyarados are big money makers. That's crazy. I kind of want a Gyarados. That just reminds me of Blaze again. <laughs> so many reminders of Blaze. <laughs> Everywhere I look, Glazed. <laughs> Everywhere I look, Death, 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 and Glazed. <laughs> okay, so Riley's gonna give us a Rylu egg. So even though we botched the first two encounters, uh, or the last two encounters we had on this in this episode, he's gonna give us this uh, Rylu egg. Within due course, that egg will hatch into a Rylu. When it does, I want you to show it to the world. I have no doubt that's in your capability, Nappy. Oh, and of course he didn't set the happiness down. JK, we're good. Ha! 
Okay, so we're gonna have a Rylu pop out of this bitch. I'm guessing it's gonna be level 20. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be at level 20. Oh, and look, our sprites are just gone. It's up. Never mind, it's level 1. Wait, it hatched from an egg. What's wrong with me? Of course it's level 1. I'm so stupid. It's naive nature, which isn't terrible. Naive, I think, uh, raises speed and lowers special defense. And it's not like he's bulky to begin with. I was sitting here thinking, I got this mixed up with, like, an event Pokemon. I was sitting here thinking, oh, he's gonna be level 20 because he's an event Pokemon. JK, it's not. It just hatched from an egg, so it's gonna be level 1. I should know that. We're doing an egg log. <laughs> but alright, let's find out where our last box was at and swap out this Ryalu for whatever it's gonna be. We can save some rare candy so we don't have to level it up because it's level 1. But alright, big money, no whammy, big money, no whammy, big money, no whammy, stop! Big money, no whammy, big money, no whammy, big money, no whammy, stop! Level 1, Jerry, holding leftovers. Now, I know I nicknamed my Heracross Jerry. So I wonder if this will be a Heracross or not. Nah. We have another set of leftovers. We have like five leftovers now. But let's see, will this be Jerry the Heracross or not? Nah? It's the Skarmory! I've never heard of Jerry the Skarmory, but you know what, Jerry? What is up? I'd be like, hey, what's up? Hello. Jerry, I saw your pretty ass when you walked through the dough. Impish Nature, Rockhead, Leer, Peck, Sky Attack, and Pursuit. Let's double check it. Let's double check it. Sky Attack sounds kind of iffy to me. Sky Attack sounds kind of iffy to me, but let's double check. Let's double check. What was it? Leer, Peck, Sky Attack, and Pursuit. Everything but Leer and Peck are start moves. Okay. Sky Attack and Pursuit are both egg moves as well. Good job, you guys. Good job. Another successfully gen Pokemon. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to go ahead and drop off Jerry here for us and scoop up Drowska. Jerry's actually a... Jerry is honestly a great addition to the party. I don't think I've ever used a Skarmory before, period, in a Let's Play. And that would give us a Mon that can use Fly as well. So if anything happens to our team, we could have a really, really defensive Mon and Skarmory and a Flyer at the same time. So... That's not bad. But I think for right now, we're going to go ahead and wrap up today's episode of Storm Silver. In the next episode, we're going to head north to the Lake of Rage and discover the man in black with the cape that's been running around and seeing if we can stop what's happening to the Magikarp at the Lake of Rage as well. So if you guys enjoyed today's episode of Storm Silver, and of course, if you're a proud member of the Mappy Nation, make sure you smash that like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. And of course, if today's episode and Wednesday's episode can break a powerful 7,000 likes, which I know the Nappy Nation nation can do then friday's episode will be an hour of power with that i'm gonna get about here thank you all once again for your support and thank you for checking out the video you'll be youtube at 182 uh -huh.